Hello and welcome back to Mass Effect 3, where, uh, well, last time we filled around a bit, so I say today we head back to the Citadel and do some uh, stuff around there, hand in some quests and stuff there. I think we still have some uh, that we can hand in there. Explored a lot of the galaxy, so that's good. We did most of the scavenging, so we are, might be heading towards endgame. Maybe hit the Illusement base, but first, yes, Citadel. So that first dock here. First of the normal line stocks, hands in. You're clear to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? Uh, let us go to... I think we have something to deliver at the embassies. the embassies. Yes, Commander. It's been a while since I played, I have to get used to the controls a bit again. So let's see, I think we have that Elcor over here that we help with this platter. That should round up the quest, I think. We got your people off to Kuna, Ambassador. Utterly sincere. Thank you for your assistance, Commander. This is not a debt you can repay. Yes. How many? Okay. Not enough. Okay, that should be complete. I saw another. Sorry, it's war strategist. Here we go. Excuse me. I'm Commander Shepard. If you promise to be careful, I've got something for you. It's a, a Reaper bomb. code fragment. Oh. Yes, I can use this to try to predict their strategic processes. We might be able to save a few worlds with this, Commander. Thank you. Okay, so that is delivered. Wow, the Turians are standing all in line and very much ready for battle. Look, I filled out all the forms a lot of security around. I just get the feeling like there's more security than there was before. That's new. Uh, let's see, what else do we have that we might still have to deliver up on? To go all the way back to top. We have chemical treatment that is in the hospital. Presidium Commons. Yeah, that's apartment. Purgatory. Yeah, I think most of it is in Purgatory or uh, the Presidium Carbon, so let us go there then. Actually, let's have a quick look in with the uh, Spectre station. Nothing new here. Heating stabilizers. Okay, purchase these. Argus. This is only 7,000. Yeah, that's worth a buy. Oh, that pretty much means we have no more money left. Well, that's fine then. Ain't gonna be no money when the universe is destroyed, you know? Argus 2. I think that's a new assault rifle, so that's nice as well. So, uh, purgatory, we have a lot to hand in, so let us head there. Party. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Party place, yes. Ah, here we go. Hello there, Angry Alcor. I recovered the code of the Ancients from Dakuna. It's waiting for you in Bay D24. Good, we got money. Shock and joy. Really, this is wonderful news. Thank you, human. Sincerely, this will greatly aid our people. Cool. Okay, so that's a bit of money. Uh, what Anyhow, else? Do we enough have? about my armor. Let's find the gang and celebrate while I'm still here. Which part? I took 
Okay. Oh, maybe we can talk with her. I've recovered some text from a library in Reaper-controlled space. I can have them waiting for you at Bay D24 if that would help. Really? More cash. Damn, couldn't hurt. Thank you. Maybe that's Hell yeah! Well, I think I saw her camp fight pretty well. Uh, journal. So, do we have anything more? Uh, Miranda Cell, chemical treatment, that's the hospital? Comments? The colonists of Eden Primer fighting Cerberus occupation. Help them move them by giving them Cerberus intel. Okay, I don't know what that one is about, but I think we're done here with the bar then apparently. So the next one is uh, Presidian Commons, so we have to deliver stuff. And then we deliver stuff at uh, the, uh, what was it? The uh, hospital, and then we should have most of the fetch quests uh, done. Status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. And you know, er everything for a bit more cash and a bit more war score. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Now, I think we have to deliver those heating modules uh, somewhere over here. If I remember correctly. As fighting continues, the Reapers now control. Was it this fellow? Yes. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Mm -hmm. Maybe these heating stabilizer schematics could help? This is amazing. The colonists. Oh, I sister, only got like a pleased. thousand Thank credits you. for that. I am in your debt. It was not that much worth it. So that is done. That's a cool gun, by the way. Different colors. Very nice. Okay, so now all we have to do is basically deliver to the hospital from what I'm seeing. Inspector status recognized. Please select a destination. One moment, please. Let's hope I got that stuff for chemical burns. And the prime now resistance thing. I don't know how that Royal exactly hospital. is uh, supposed to help or work or whatever. Probably have to go to Eden Prime, I guess. Let's take up. Okay, let's walk around, see when the thing pops up. Hello? Yes, General Corellius should make a full recovery. Cool, but that's not what I wanted. Chemical burns. Where would they need stuff for chemical burns? Ah, here we go. I came across this treatment plant at a chemical plant. Could it help? Treatment? What Only is... a thousand. I've Sad. never seen this kind of process before. Huh. Probably experimental. It's a long shot, but let's run some tests and see if it might work for our patient. Cool. Okay. Now, check up on the journal. I think we have a lot of ticks in boxes. So there's some around the cell thing, yes, shore leaf, resistance Eden Prime, and the main attack. So yes, I think, uh, you know what, for some reason right now I think it's a good time to have some shore leaf. Sure, we are supposed to be attacking the service base, but you know, shore leaf first. Honestly, because I think there might not be a chance to have shore leaf after we attack the service base. From what I remember, at least, it's uh, kind of a very end gamey thing. So we go to. Uh, Can we just please. go to the Normandy docking base and then take a transit from there? Yeah. 
Now arriving at docking bay D24. So, uh, oh, okay, I guess we have to go from the Normandy to the new apartment. Can we just go back? I would very much appreciate to just go back. Oh well. Alright, repark the ship, Joker! I don't want to want Come to take on, a cab. Message at your private terminal. Really? Fuck you. How the man in fertilized embryos. Apprehensive, discreetly, Akuna, city of Elvis. Is that a new job? I think that's a new job. Yeah, Spectre job. Uh, okay, bow well, date. That's not the Spectre screen. Do I authorize that? Okay, let's see. Or is it somewhere for something I have to fly to? Travel to Akuna. Okay, yeah, so do, so we do have a little bit of space flying going. We'll save that for later. Actually, let's also check in how that Cerberus uh, operation that Miranda is running is going. Ah, Issy's back. Hello, Miranda. Shepard, there you are. Do you have a minute, Miranda? I'm just finishing an operation report. I'll let you work. Okay, let's see that operation report. Because I think that means that the job is done. Report plus 8,000. Reporters got close. Battle was short, but bloody prisoner was discovered. A drill operative in a quail. In return for help to escape, he agreed to work with Miranda. Okay, so there's a whole like little mission thingy going on here. So low risk. Recruitment center. That might mean we got more like help. High probability of civilian casualties. I think I will fund this mission. No more recruitment things. And then Miranda is gone, and then she will be gone for a while. Not sure if we can do Commander much Shepherd. with that uh, mechanic, but uh, it's neat. Anyways, yes. Joker! Repark this the ship! Yeah, I'll skip this, which we've seen it before. In a previous episode, look it up. It's a fancy Commander, apartment and Amazon gives it to us. How nice. Alright, so here we are, back at the uh, at the apartment. Let's go through some of the notes that uh, Anderson left here. The Norman? You have received a new message. A brand new ship. My ship. You don't forget that moment. Mm -hmm. The first time you're standing there. And then it's mine. Ah! The whole crew looking to you for direction. Unforgettable. I'd led men and women before that. Seen a lot of combat already. Always managed to find my way home in one piece. To do that a few times, you begin to think you know better than the next guy. Maybe you do, I don't know. But if you're lucky, really lucky, you find yourself on a good ship. In front of a good crew. Ah, but what's a, a bad ship with a bad crew? Life. Gifted. Disciplined. Brave. All of them. Eager to set sail into the endless black ocean. I still remember my exo asking what my orders were. Shepard, I said. Let's see what we can find. 
I don't remember that conversation. I think Anderson is a little drunk. Okay, what other notes uh, do we have here? We have uh, the N17. Embarrassing moment? I've got more of those than anyone will ever know. Only way to learn something. But if I had to pick one to share... I had just gotten promoted to N7. Full of myself. King of the castle. Hell yeah. Found myself buying drinks for undesirables in some rundown bar in the wards. They toasted my recent promotion. And then you got robbed? They would have toasted Batarian slavers if it had got them more drinks. About the time my money ran out, my new friends turned on me. Ah, yeah. I was outnumbered. Things didn't look good. My plan to get out of there involved lots of punching. Well, that worked for a while. Then a table hit me. Or I fell down. When I came to, I saw a Solarian putting the rest of the troublemakers down. Was that Solarian a more Solarian. than Solus? Move like a damn cat, I swear. When everybody was out cold. Or running. He walked over and helped me up. N7, he asked. Yes, sir, I replied. He looked over my collection of unconscious friends, nodding. Not bad, human, he said. And he... Walked away. I had met my first spectre. Ah, okay, really so not more than so. No matter how good you think you are, there's always somebody quicker, faster, and a hell of a lot smarter than you just around the corner. That little lesson's kept me alive more than once since then. Okay, cool story, bro. Uh, let's see, the other, other notes. Yeah, here we go. You never asked me about this, but my wife just called. My ex-wife. Nobody likes to talk about the toll that long months apart can have on military relationships. She wasn't military. She couldn't handle it. But it's mm -hmm. not even about military and non-military, damn it. It's space flight. Space flight. Finding the mass relays, miracles of engineering. Human imagination rising to meet our desires. Mm, we pay a price for that curiosity, that drive. Our relationships suffer. People we love suffer. But that's reality. And it's worth the cost. I must have thought it was. I guess I still do. In the end, you just have to hope you made the right choices. It's quite a party on the other side of the street. We are quite a hippening part of town. Hippening, happening, whoopity, weaponing. Yeah, yeah, I heard the beep. I first want to look at some notes. Here we go. Okay. I have your new questions here. Oh, okay, so I guess it's from an interview or something. Do I ever feel that the end justify the means? Spirit of law over word of law. I'm not going to touch that with a ten-foot pole. I think I know what you're after. You're referring to the way I, um... Oh, damn it! It cut out when we got too far. I have your new questions here. Can I skip this? As a leader, do I ever feel that the end justify the means? Because it's probably about punching Spirit Odina. Of that was great. I'm not going to touch that with a ten-foot pole, but I think I know what you're after. You're referring to the way I, um... Arranged to have the Normandy released to Commander Shepard. Hell yeah! The Battle of the Citadel. I'm not sure how valuable hindsight is to the military. Obviously, it worked out for the best. Without the Normandy and Commander Shepard free to do what they needed to do, what we needed them to do, Saren might have taken the Citadel. I think it's clear Probably. what a different galaxy this would be if that had happened. I did what I had to. If I had been wrong, I would have gladly accepted the repercussions. The real trick is. Never being wrong. <laughs> if you're looking for more action and less philosophy in these notes, let me know. Yeah, I think they wanted more about the punching. How good it feels uh, if your knuckles crack against Udina's smart face. Any more notes? Yes. Oh, me! Me, me, me! Sure, I can talk about Commander Shepard. Big topic. There's been a lot written about the Commander. But most of it isn't true. I disagree. People are quick to judge. 
They don't know the whole story. I don't even know the whole story. But I know the man. Worked with him. Fought with him. Trust him with my life. Shepard's had some rough patches. Who of us hasn't? He's been forced to fight a lot of battles alone. God only knows how he got out of some of that. Makes your head spin. Thing is... Makes my head spin crazy! You never heard a complaint. Never once, Scott. No, sir, I can't do that. He never hesitated. Few people know what Shepard's been through. I'd like to think I come pretty close. And I worry sometimes he forgets. There's a whole bunch of people who lose sleep over him getting back home. Maybe it doesn't need to be said. Hmm. Maybe we're too dumb to say it. Soldiers like the Commander are rare. Men like Shepard? Even more rare. I wonder if that is adapted to whatever uh, our Paragon Renegade thing is and maybe background and such, because that did sound seem to hint to the Lone Survivor uh, story a little bit. I think at this point we can probably just uh, do that uh, mission. Contact, ah, we'll, 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 we'll go and do that another time. So, first, yeah. Terminal. Dinner at the sushi place on me. Yeah, let's go have sushi with Joker. That sounds like a great idea. So, up de up de up Over and out. So now you get the full sushi experience that I cut off last time. Ha ha! Sounds like quite a party. And that looks like a club across the street. Do we really have to drive so far? Do all clubs look the same? One of those people are pissed. Yeah, they are pissed. We're gonna get killed now. Ah, oh, Commander Shepard. Your table is ready. Why do you have a French accent in the sushi place? Is French, uh, French fusion, uh, French Japanese fusion cooking a thing in the future? I guess it's a thing right now. I guess. Yeah, you know what? I get back to that. This, maybe this is an awesome idea. Hello there, bartender. Good evening. Would the gentleman care for a drink? Maybe later. I'm meeting a friend. Yeah, no, it's not Iceland either. They all have French accents here. Someone let me know if French-Japanese uh, fusion cooking is a thing. Joker, why did you pick your tables so far in the back? Oh, well. Hey, Shepard, not bad, huh? The sushi place is serious. Like, French guy at the door serious. Only had to save the galaxy twice to get a table here. You see the line outside? But here I am, okay. drink in hand. Best pilot in the universe and a rock star. <laughs> Any news from the Normandy? Ah, oh, you know, maintenance stuff. It's hard knowing a bunch of strangers are poking around in my ship. I, I mean, your ship. So yeah, apparently the Normandy has been temporarily kind of uh, put into dock and is getting a redone uh, right now. So we can't leave the Citadel. That's very smart, you know, while the Cerberus is at the base and everything. But really, there isn't really a good time for that. Uh, maybe after the Quarian thing, but that uh, would have some other problems, so. Oh well, we'll do it right here then. Yeah, our ship. The best thing Communism. we can do right now is Parker and let the techs do their work. Okay. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Maybe an oil change, space tire rotation. Right. Trust me, it'll do her some good. Oh, I trust you. 
Not sure about those shifty aerospace engineers. Always stealing the silverware. Yeah, fine. It's not easy to hand the ship over to somebody else. I just don't want anybody touching her but me. Mm. That, that sounded a little weird. Yeah, not from you. Ouch. So, Commander, your email said it was important. What's up? Hi, huh? email. I'm here because I got a message from you. The hell? I, I didn't send anything. Commander! Excuse me. Sorry. Lion's business. Commander, this is urgent! Okay. Oh, come on, we haven't even gotten the appetizers yet. Commander Shepard, I'm Staff Analyst Maya Brooks. Alliance, excuse me, Alliance Intelligence. There are people trying to kill you. Yeah, that's not new. <laughs> yeah, I think he's aware of that. No, I don't mean Cerberus and the Reapers. I mean other people, new people. They're, it's... <sighs> oh, great. Someone is hacking your account. Comm channels, personal records. They're targeting you specifically. Damn it! Big mistake. Oh man, there's the angry face. From the top, what do you know? Excuse me, you don't have a reservation. Yeah, they have guns, so... Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight's performance is brought to you by Random Acts of Violence. Cool! I like that performance. Get down. Man, I love show business. Man, I agree. That, that Merc knows how, how it's done. Stay there. I'm coming. Joker? Ow, my pancreas. Hey! That's not a bone. Damn it. Got one, sir! Find the crew. I'm going after her. Find the crew. Got it. Okay, random acts of violence, let's pull on out. Show damage. Hit, hit. Ow, motherfuckers! I dislike that guy specifically. And that guy too. Yeah, mine are not so much random, but more much more targeted exoplanets. Oh yeah, I have powers, I forgot about that too. You know what, I should use those powers. Yeah, let's do that. Guys, uh, how's your... Here, have some shocking amounts of violence. Yeah! Commander! Oh, oh, shit. Commander! I know. Oh, there's more. Hello. Hey, guys. Shocking surprise for you. You're dead! Commander! I'm with you. <coughs> oh shit. Brooks. Oh shit. Building apartment, possibly to my death. I'll be bombarded by advertisements. This is not a great day for pie. 